You ready to fight? You ready? All right, one of the best middleweights in the world at present, Drake is Duplessis, prioritizing a fast start tonight as we get underway in round one. Not as though he's been a fighter who historically plays with his food at times, but Duplessis doesn't want to give his opponent any window for optimism nor confidence. As such, he felt like his jab was going to lead the dance, and eventually his right hand would close the show. Lands a big right hand early. All right, so there it is. We expected a lot of takedown attempts early from the more well-rounded fighter. The kickboxer stays upright, and amazing to see the progression of his takedown defense relative to his UFC debut. Well, when he first got here, he was just a kickboxer, but this is not glory. This is not you being able to stand and just throw. You've got to be able to defend your legs, and he showed that he is a martial artist now, not just a kickboxer. Oh, beautiful land there by Adesanya. You hear this crowd just eating out of his hand, oohing and on every time he advances. I mean, he just captures your imagination from the walkout to the entrance when he's in the octagon, the fighting style. He just kind of has that thing that makes you want to stop and stare at Israel Adesanya. Fast pace here in the early going. Oh, nice jab there by Adesanya. So both guys landing at will here. Good action early. Well, he keeps going back to the will with that left hand just out of range. Nice punch there by Duplessis. And there he goes, lands another combination. His cardio is so good that, is, that it allows him to put forth this type of output and pace. When his opponent is done at two, he is stringing together four, five, six more different strikes. You don't do that without having fantastic cardio. Oh, nice right hand. 25 total strikes have now landed for the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. So there it is, DC, the fighter with the longer reach, able to counter flush with a straight punch. Heavy leather landed on both sides in that exchange. Finds a home for that left hook. Good takedown defense by Israel. All right, so now blood is a factor. You see that he has been opened up in that eye area. Yeah, he's got hit in the eye. And oh! Oh, man, huge strike lands, and now he's going to tell him about it, too. I'm no lip reader, but that was not nice. Not nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Two minutes now to go. All right, so an opportunity goes by the boards. He had him stunned, nearly finished, and now his opponent has won. The opponent recovered. Now he's got to deal with everything that he's going to bring at him. He should have got the fight finished at that time. Well, it didn't take long tonight for Israel Adesanya to find his striking flow late in the round here. He's fainting, the jab's going, the footwork just beautiful. When he's going good, Izzy is a hard problem to solve. And it all comes back to the striking. He can dominate a fight with his stand-up ability, and that's exactly what you're seeing tonight. being doled out, and now some swelling upstairs on his opponent. He's not moving his head effectively. He's trying to be face first. Look, you don't have to prove how tough you are. You gotta move your head, be active. Don't be reactive in your defenses. Under a minute to go. And that's, that's the danger in the engagement there. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Ooh, head kick Lance was hurt. Woo. Israel Adesanya, I don't even know what that was, but it certainly looked pretty, DC. This man brings so many different things to the table as a striker, and I would think would be a very difficult guy for his fellow middleweight contenders to prepare for. All right, so perhaps he's going to have to address something defensively. There is a legitimate cut around his eye. Yeah, he got cut. Oh! Final seconds of the round. Oh, he hurt him again, bro. Drops to the side. Big, big strikes continue to land. All right, so there's the horn at the 
the end of the round. Thankfully for him, he will live to see another round. You saw him get knocked down near the end of the round. If there were 10 more seconds, that likely would have been the end of his night. You look okay to me. He's taking way bigger shots than that. All right, that was nothing. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. We had a knockdown there, but not a knockout. No, it wasn't a knockout, but you can't take those shots. That big punch landed, and it sat him down. If he gets hit with another one of those, it might be good night, Irene. Ready to fight? Ready. Let's go. All right. Round two. Nice punch to the head. Oh, blocked that offering there and then counters beautifully with a leg kick. Nice job by Asanya. Fairly. Oh, he's got Oh, big left. Oh, he got him again. Like that. There it is. Now he's going to mount. Oh, he's got to be careful there, yep. He Bottom needs fighter to better move. Yeah, he's got to move, Johnny. He's got to shrimp and try to either get up or pull his opponent back into him so he doesn't have the posture to land that big damage. Adesanya's right back to the full mount. Oh, nice elbow. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. And a miss with the right hook. Man, that is loud. Another strike lands for the kickboxer. He really found that flow state pretty early in this fight, and he hasn't looked back. He found it really early. And when this guy gets into his groove, he is hell on wheels. And right now, he is showing why he is such a high-level, high-regarded kickboxer. He is outclassing this guy. Israel Adesanya has got a bruise now, starting to appear on the right side of his body. Big shot to the bottom. Oh, nice stick by Adesanya. Let's get busy with those hands now, man. Come on. Adesanya lands. Oh, nice. Oh, no. And we get back to his feet yet again. Oh, but not a good look for the judges here. Look how wobbly he is. Great block there. Another strike hits that eye area, and it is getting messier by the minute up there. Well, he's getting targeted now. He's been hitting that spot so many times. That's... He's hurt bad. He's got to move. They're going to stop this fight if he doesn't move. What a fight. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Duplessis now dealing with a cheap cut. Oh, nice land there with the punch. You see, he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge in reach. Well, you got to think it's only a matter of time. Yup, referee stopping the action here. That swelling is getting out of control. This might be the end, DC. It's bad. I mean, it's a lot of swelling. And it's the damage that he has taken over the course of the fight that is making him swell to a point that I don't know if he can continue. Looks as though the doctor is going to allow the fight to continue for the athlete. May want to raise the guard a little bit. He's got to raise the guard. He's got to take some chances because he's very limited and what he can do right now with that much slow. All right, so the ringside position has made his... Oh! oh my goodness! Whoa! What a performance! What an absolute freak of a knockout here tonight. That's a three-check knockout, right? Show money, win money, bonus money. Absolutely, J.A. There's nothing more exciting than a knockout in sports. You don't see it anywhere but mixed martial arts. This young man will celebrate this deep into the night as he should. Here's the buff with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 35 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout.